All right, ladies and gents, we finished spotting our evidence onto our chromatography plate. As you can see here, very nice dark spots for each sample. And now it's time to place our sample into the chromatography tank. Now, at the bottom of the chromatography tank, as you can see, there's about a centimeter of the lipstick developer. Now, this is a different mixture of solvents that will essentially start moving up our plate via capillary action, dissolve the organic components of our lipstick dots, our little stains there, at the, uh, at the spotting line, and then start to spread them out up the face of the plate. Now remember, some of the substances will like the solvents a little bit more than others, and that means they will travel farther. So as time goes on, uh, they will spread apart on the plate, making very distinct colored bands. And we should hopefully see some invisible bands under ultraviolet light as well. But to do that, first we have to put it in the tank. So let's do that. So first we're going to remove our top from our tank. It's very stinky, that's why it's in the fume hood. We're going to grab our plate here, like so. And then we're going to place it very carefully into our... going to place this on top and let's take a closer look here and you can see the solvent is already starting to move up the face of the plate so what we're gonna do is we're gonna pause here I'm gonna set up a time to lapse and we should be able to see this as it goes over the next about an hour